Have you given any thought to going organic? If you have, then please start thinking about getting your plans together before the end of this month. Because on the 1st of March, I'm delighted to say I'm going to be delivering on one of my key priorities as Minister of State in the Department of Agriculture, and that is the reopening of the organic farming scheme. And not only is it reopening, but in the budget I secured enough funding to allow, we reckon, between four and 500 extra farmers to join the scheme and to start their two-year journey to full organic status. So if you're in a position to do so, please think about it. I'm a big believer in organic farming myself and I practice what I preach, not just because it delivers for the environment, but also because it delivers for the bottom line. Since becoming organic, my husband and I find our input costs are lower because we don't use any synthetic fertilisers or pesticides, and we also use significantly less fuel as a result. Organic products can attract a premium price, of course, as well, especially in the case of dairy, fruit and veg and grains. So a switch can definitely increase profit margins. And as for the environment, well, the benefits of organic farming are immense. It delivers improved biodiversity, cleaner rivers and streams, it's better for soil health and it lowers carbon emissions. So please, if you are thinking about it, do take the time between now and the beginning of March to research the organic option and see if it'll suit you and your farm. Yes, the initial transition can be challenging, but that's why we support farmers entering the scheme with a higher premium for the two year conversion period. And if you do decide to give it a whirl, well, we will be looking forward to your application.